Hello everyone, welcome to Akash Institute. In this new video series, we are discussing the different counselling processes of the states and UTs of India for NEET 2024. Today, we are going to discuss Goa. In our discussion, we will talk about seat matrix, cutoff analysis and the entire counselling process of Goa. You can visit this website for more information on the same. Let's first take a look at the MBBS and BDS seat matrix of Goa. As you can see, there is one MBBS college and one BDS college. There are 180 seats in the MBBS college and 50 seats in the BDS college. You can take a look at the map and understand where these colleges are. This is the combined list of the MBBS and BDS colleges. Please note the names, locations and the number of seats in them. Now we will talk about the different quota categories of the MBBS college in Goa. So there are two categories, 85% state quota and 15% all India quota. If you take admission in this college, you will pay 5 to 6 lakh rupees for the entire course approximately. Now we will talk about the 2023 MBBS cutoff rank of Goa. This was for general, OBC, SC and ST. Now let's look at the different steps in the counselling process. It starts with online registration, the link has been given. Then the combined merit list of the eligible candidates for counselling is published. Then comes choice filling, then allotment of seats and in the end you report at the allotted college. Now what about eligibility criteria? If you are looking for the seats reserved for the localites of Goa, you should know that you must be a permanent resident of Goa to do that. Now here is the list of documents you need in the counselling process. Qualifying examination mark sheet and certificates 10th and 12th, NEET mark sheet, domicile certificate if needed, category certificate if needed, PWD certificate if needed, passport size photographs and government identity proof. Now what about scholarship? Yes, there is scholarship under post matrix scholarship scheme for whom? For ST candidates. What is the requirement? The total family annual income is to be less than or equal to 2.5 lakh rupees per annum. You can visit this website for more information on the same. What about service bond? You have to serve the government for one year after the completion of your course or you will pay 10 lakh rupees as penalty. So we have come to the end of this video. Hope you understood the counselling process of Goa. Thank you for watching.